the next video. So this one is building a CNC machine. Excuse all the rubbish. Got to tidy the whole workshop up. Yeah, so I decided to build another CNC machine. I built one years ago, 10 years ago, before I had 3D printers, and that was brilliant. But decided to go with the NPCNC, mostly printed CNC. CNC just means computer numerical control. It controls the motors and pulls the head wherever you want it to cut. Uh, link to V1 Engineering, who designed this machine, is in the link below, in the description below. Really well designed. It's gone through loads of iterations to get to this design. I printed all the parts, no support. They came straight off the printer. I haven't cleaned them. They've gone straight onto the print, into the build. That is all, nothing's broken, everything's worked. It, yeah, it's brilliant. Uh, you can go to his site, you can just get the parts list, the 3D files, and source everything yourself and do it. Or you can buy the whole kit off him or parts off him. I bought the electronics, the stepper motors, and the uh, hardware kit off him. Mainly because one, support other makers. He's put a lot of effort into this and he must make some money from selling the stuff. Two, it was cheaper than buying it in New Zealand. So, yeah, uh, the steel pipe I got you, I printed all the parts. I know there's been no videos for a while. I've, I've been having a break and the break turned into, well, doing nothing for a year. I think it's coming up as a year. So I have made stuff. I have finished the wood oven. I've bought a table saw. I've made a river table. I bought a resin printer. I have been doing stuff. I have been filming it. I just haven't been editing it work gets in the way of all the fun stuff so anyway this is a bit messed up i did have two cameras going the one that was in a fixed station position i normally take the cards out every day put them into the nas or on my pc for a backup but i didn't want to move the fixed position and it had this intro on it all the parts all the electronics all the components everything i bought it had all the look down of what I was doing and when I took the card out the other day it was corrupt so I lost all that film so I have just put this together from the one camera I was moving around and using uh, and it's not a how-to on how to build it it's just how I built it what I've built and then at the end it shows it working and the next video will be tidying up putting the spindle on and cutting some wood so hope you enjoy That's the base made. I know it looks friggin' huge. I think that's because it is friggin' huge. But that's the size I'm gonna try.
Okay, every one of my electric screwdrivers is flat. Well, that one's not. So that is hard to see sixteen forty seven. And then if I go to this corner, sixteen forty seven. So that's square.
the CNC so X rail Y rail Z axis the wiring is still a bit of you know, this is just testing so all the wiring is uh, a mess yeah so at the moment I got no limit switches nothing it's just straight steppers touch screen and it's connected to the computer as well. So I'm using Repertier Host. I can do all the movement from here. So let's move Z up. Let's do a 10. So I'm going to print, draw the crown, and we see how that goes. Okay, so here we go. Okay, that worked apart from, I think the pen came down a mill too far. And that's what it drew, the crown. So, yeah, I'm quite pleased with that. That's working. So I need to print the mount for the cutter head. Do some more print testing. That'll be in the next video. And go from there pretty impressed with that need to do all the wires need to put it over in the corner it's going over there all this stuff's going away 
yeah. Quite pleased with it. I got some Welsh dragon outlines, so I might try printing those later. If I do, I will film it and we'll see how it goes. And the next one will be tidying all this up, putting the spindle on, and actually cutting some wood. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hit the like button if you liked, hit the dislike if you disliked, subscribe if you want to see the rest of them and everything else I mess about with. See you in the next one.